everyone welcome back to my channel as you can see I have no makeup on because I'm going to do a really quick review on a product that I just got in now I know I am NOT the only girl in the world that shaves the little baby hairs off of her face I just find that I get a smoother application for foundation and all that and my face just looks a lot better so I purposely did not um, shave or pluck my face hairs <laughs> um, in a few days actually like two weeks just so I could review this product for you guys I have not used it yet so we will see how it goes this is the finishing touch flawless uh, facial hair remover now they do have a white version of this I believe that was the first one they came out with but you had to um, use batteries with it I never did buy that one but I did see people use it this is their newer one which I'm actually excited about because for one I like black anyway <laughs> as you can tell from like my desk and my makeup drawers I'm not like a oh I want a white vanity no I love my black it comes in this case and you just have to peel the back part and then slide it out it has the little pamphlet like that and the thing I like about this black one is that it doesn't run off of batteries it's actually rechargeable so it comes with the charger right there it also comes with the brush to clean it and then this is the product itself so as you can see it's super sleek like it's just really appealing <laughs> um, it has the gold on the gold detail and the package itself is like a matte soft black it does say flawless on it so you open it up and this is what it looks like I'm pretty sure these things come with like a little bit of life in them let's see let's test it out so Oh, it's really not that loud. I don't know if my camera's picking it up. It does say that it is gentle on all skin types. The actual head of the uh, hair remover is 18 karat gold plated, and they do sell um, replaceable heads for it. And it does say that it was dermatologist approved. Now, on the bottom, I just noticed it says peel and use in a circular motion, which I was going to mention because when I saw a video of it, um, when I first bought it, it, sh it shows like going in small circular motions for it to work. Um, and then it says gentle on all skin types, no bumps, no redness, no irritation. So we'll see about that. Um, and then it also <laughs> says right here at the bottom of the box, Hair will not grow back thicker, guaranteed. I freaking hope not. Okay, so I am going to go ahead and zoom you guys in. I hope I don't scare you, but we're gonna go ahead and test this baby out and see how it works on all my baby hairs because I am just dying for a smooth face again. I don't even think we know each other this personally where you should be this close in all of in my business. <laughs> Anyway, we're just going to turn it on and see how this baby works. Okay, so I don't know if you guys can see, but this is like the before I know so disgusting don't mind my mouth um, the dry weather has been like really tough on my skin but um, you can see all of my like mustache hairs and then this is after so it really does um, it really is working right now um, I'm actually quite impressed it doesn't hurt it doesn't burn my skin doesn't feel irritated it actually does feel really smooth so I'm going to go ahead and finish up this side and then we'll see how it does um, on like my sideburn areas all right you guys I know you're still zoomed in <laughs> but um, I, first impression I'm actually really quite impressed it was really easy to use 
it almost looks as if I shaved my face um, but this was just way more comfortable to use and like it says uh, no bumps no redness no irritation and right now I'm not feeling any of that so yeah I know sometimes after like shaving my mustache it does feel a bit sensitive but it literally feels like nothing so I'm gonna go ahead and try to do like the sides of my face this side of my face, I do have a bit of hyperpigmentation, but um, it's just like you can see the hairs a lot more. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Alright you guys, so I did go downstairs and uh, rinse off my face a bit to just get off those little baby hairs and of course make myself more coffee. I'm actually very happy that I picked it up. Yes, I put it back in the box. I feel like, especially my mustache area, it feels like I literally just shaved it. But it's so smooth, um, it didn't irritate my skin at all. And the cut that it gave me is just so close to my skin, like it literally feels like I shaved, you know that feeling, like does anybody shave with conditioner sometimes and then your legs are just like extra smooth? That's how my face feels right now and I am just loving it. Uh, like I said, I used to go to Ross and buy those little electric um, shavers that you can use on like your bikini line or like your face or like the small, you know, tiny areas of your face and it never cut, it, it just didn't cut as close to the skin as I would want to like I would still feel the facial hairs and I would spend like maybe 10 12 dollars on those um, this one was $30 but the fact that you can recharge it and then um, the head plates they're replaceable I think that it's worth it it's just really beautiful to look at I could even like discreetly just leave this on my vanity and no one would even think anything of it like it's just so pretty I'm so glad that they went with the black and the gold um, versus the white there was nothing wrong with the white one um, besides the fact that you have to use batteries but I love that this one is rechargeable so final thoughts I definitely recommend this if any of my ladies on here like to shave their face um, it's a good tip if you want like a smoother foundation application because those little hairs and that peach fuzz, it can affect the way that your foundation looks. So I like to maybe like two to three times a week, I'll go ahead and shave my face. And now I think I'm going to feel a lot more comfortable using this because from the reviews that I've seen on the white one, um, people had to shave a lot less when they were using this versus an actual like a regular razor So yeah, you guys I really hope that you enjoyed uh, this little review and demo I know it's not exactly makeup related, but it could tie into makeup, you know So that your makeup looks more flawless if you guys did enjoy this review Go ahead and give the video a thumbs up. I love hearing your feedback and just feeling like we are a big ohana and speaking of ohana if you are new here please don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you can join my youtube ohana we are all so nice and friendly we love to chat compliment each other's videos and just support each other from the bottom of my heart i just want to say thank you guys so much for being here and being so kind and being so positive and supporting my channel um, I love to support all of you guys. I love watching your guys' videos. It's so entertaining to me. I just, I love YouTube. So, yeah, um, I just wanted to say thank you guys for that. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and night wherever you are. And know that you are beautiful. And I love you. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Aloha.